from Caribbean sunshine to the chilly slopes of the Yanqing district of Beijing, the Jamaican bobsleigh team is headed to this year's Winter Olympics. They're billing it as fire on ice. Now the whole island's rooting for their athletes, including Nimroy Turgot, who's never made it to the international event before. They, they see how, how I train and how serious I am about sports. Like waking up 4.30 in the morning to do a training session. It's the first time the team has qualified in 24 years. The country will also compete in the women's monobob. The new event has been added to the Olympic roster by the IOC. And Jamaica's Jasmine Fenlater Victorians tipped to wear the green and gold colours of her flag at that race after she participated in the 2018 Games in South Korea. Despite this flurry of excitement, the Jamaican athletes are not quite in pole position, as equipment is limited and training in a country with no snowfall presents significant challenges. An online fundraiser for vital resources has raised some $7,000 so far, but it's still some way off their target of almost $200,000. The Jamaican team fears that a lack of financial support could give the advantage to the bobsleigh frontrunners, Germany. Because we have the athletes. Jamaica definitely have the athletes. But equipment-wise, we, we don't have the best equipment. Um, but we're, we're not complaining. We have to go out there and use what we have and perform to the best of our ability to represent our beautiful country, Jamaica. Jamaica's bobsleigh team made their debut at the Winter Games in Calgary in 1988, beating all odds to qualify and inspiring the Disney film Cool Runnings. Since then, they've enjoyed a warm welcome at the Olympics, however chilly the weather.